In the midst of a challenging situation, the people of Palestine continue to demonstrate unwavering resilience and hope. Despite being displaced from their homes and being victims of ruthless attacks for nearly a month, they refuse to alert their hopes and aspirations. Our special collaborator, Mohamed El Saifa, has testimonies from a displaced woman in Palestine. Let's see. When the bombing started here, it was a warning bombing. We went out, and halfway there, I remember the birds. I went back and looked for them. I was not afraid of the bombs. I looked for the birds and I came. They live with me. I sleep near them. They eat what I eat. I go out and look for food for them. Under the attacks, I look for food for them. Being in the hospital, I had the birds with me. I feed them as part of everything. I don't abandon them. As you can see, we are here in the palace of Sheikh Sayed. I moved from here to Nasser Hospital. I have been here for 21 days. It's been a devastating war. In this war, where your enemy bombs you. We gave many martyrs. It is an unworthy life. There is no water, no bread, no electricity. We have nothing. Life here is very hard, very difficult. But we always thank God. We are resisting. The whole world abandoned us. We're alone in this. 